What's going on everyone? It's Saturday and I'm wearing blue for Luba Vimoya. Now, let's get into the workout. Technically, this was supposed to be done yesterday. And when it really comes down to it, I probably could have done it. However, I didn't. Now, there are a couple of reasons for that. Number one, the night before, sleep was horrible. I don't think I actually fell asleep until about four in the morning. And that was really unexpected. I did not think that I was going to be up that late. And then I had to wake up for work because I had a couple of clients. And then I had to meet up with family for lunch after that. So I knew it was most likely that I wouldn't get it done, but that's okay. So today I got it done. I began with the behind the head push press triples with 135, 145, and 155 for the strict press. I went right into working sets just because it's only 135 pounds for 10 sets of 5, 90 seconds of rest between sets, and these are good. They're comfortable. I'm showing a little bit of a different angle, so this is more like a front, front three quarters, as opposed to the usual side or back three quarters. Get a little bit of a different perspective on the lift. You can see the paws on the chest a little bit better this way, and that's something that I will do as long as I can. So. While the weight is manageable, I'm going to try my best to at least give a good stoppage on the chest with the barbell before pressing back up, just so that they're not only strict, but also that they don't have any kind of momentum or any kind of bounce off the chest. Right now, there's no reason for that whatsoever, and so I'll keep doing it as long as I can, and then eventually it'll just be a quick stop or just reaching down to the clavicles. So all in all, good press day. Then for the accessory, I would usually just go to a dip and I'm sort of half tempted to only do dips, not only after bench press, but also after the strict press. But I did go to an old favorite today, which is a close grip incline bench press. And I like it as a direct assistance exercise just because I prefer incline benching over flat benching. So it carries right over and it's a great variation and honestly it's gotten a lot stronger for me over the years as opposed to just regular benching. So it is a way of benching that I enjoy. However, I really like dips, whether body weight or with extra weight attached. I just really like the dip for different reasons and you can always modify it whether you want to focus a little bit more on chest and include your chest or just go more towards your triceps. It all just kind of depends on your body positioning and how you do the movement. So for close grip incline bench press, I took a low incline position so I didn't use the Reebok adjustable bench and I started with a set of 10 with 135 pounds too easy that was just too easy and so what I did for working reps was 155 pounds for five sets of 10 I definitely wanted to get a little bit more volume but not go very heavy and I rested for 60 seconds between sets and that felt pretty good now will I keep the close grip incline bench press I don't know just because I really like the dip but we'll see all right y'all thank you and adopt don't chop